All right, here recently we've had a pretty good restock in all GPUs, really, even the 90s, 80s, 70s, some AMD ones as well. But today's video, I just want to show you guys. I don't know if anybody else has made a video about this yet, but there's been a restock in the past week, right? And uh, it's over multiple micro centers. I'm sh I don't know about online. I would imagine it's more likely uh, micro centers. So if you guys are lucky enough to be next to a micro center, guess what you guys can buy today? Just so you guys are aware, um, obviously these prices are insane. These are all in stock, these 5090s. But what I want you guys to look at, <clears throat> it's right here in the middle, right? You guys see that? Can you guys tell me something or if, uh, if you guys notice anything that's wrong with what you guys are looking at right now, okay? If you guys don't notice, Right there in the middle, PNY has an RTX 4090 in stock, which normally I'd be like, cool, that's kind of that's kind of cool, I guess, you know what I'm saying? But you clearly see that freaking price tag right next to it. That is $3,000 4090. Now, at first, I figured this was a typo, but you got to think they got to typo a lot of stuff that it's going to be literally a a five instead of a four it's got to be a 32 instead of 24 gigabytes and it's got to be pcie 5.0 not 4.0 so that's clearly not a typo now i don't really know what p and y or nvidia is honestly thinking about dropping 4090s at three thousand dollars please please drop a comment let me know what you guys think about this because in my opinion it's really just to make the other cards look better because if you guys go, I'm in the St. Louis area, so this is uh, the Brentwood location. But again, if you go to other locations like Tustin, let's say. Look at it. Eight in stock. 4090s, Virto triple fans for $3,000. Let's just try another one because I haven't uh, actually went through a whole bunch of these. Let's just go to Indiana. See if they got some. Oh, look at that. They got three right there. Uh, let's go to a different state. Columbus. Did you guys get lucky enough to get three thousand dollar forty nineties? Yes, you did. You got three of them as well. I don't know if this is P and Y. I don't know if this is Nvidia, but in general, what the is this crap? <laughs> like, I can understand, you know, what I'm saying restocking them because you got them, but coming in at a price of three thousand dollars, that's absolutely insane. This is literally like a freaking uh, MSRP model at that too. Is am I am I wrong? Uh, actually, the P and Y, the fifty ninety P and Y or fifty eighty P and Y MSRP one at least actually says fifty ninety or fifty eighty on the side. So maybe this isn't technically their MSRP one, but three thousand dollars. I need to go uh, to these dispensaries that these people are going to. Not really, because I'm a truck driver and I can't do that. But uh, these guys are clearly smoking something. <laughs> That's all I got to say. Now, another thing I did want to uh, kind of chime in on this video was you guys have been doing uh, pretty damn good at staying away from the 5060, the 8 gigabyte 5060 as just as like all the other big YouTubers are telling you guys, don't buy an eight gigabyte card in 2025. It's just, it's a bad idea. You're kind of just wasting your money. You know what I'm saying? Just, just save up for a little, save up a little bit longer if you absolutely need to, and just get you that, um, that 16 gigabyte 60 TI or a 9060 XT. Whenever those drop, obviously we'll see uh, benchmarks for those pretty soon. But anyway, what I wanted to do was go to these 5060s. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm just going to click right there. But uh, yeah, 5060s, they've been in stock for over a week now, about uh, nine days. And actually, I'm not going to lie. The last time I looked, these this model right here, which is the only one, actually not the only one, but it's the only triple fan at MSRP, right? There was 10 of them, and for the for about a week, a full week, only one of them sold. So within the past few days, I guess this past weekend more than likely, um, eight more sold. So unfortunately, nine people at least bought this 5060 Ti 8 gigabyte. And if that is you, I will say, just take it back. You got 30 days. I know it has not been 30 days since I've seen 10 in stock on here. So just take that crap back. 
save up a little bit longer. I understand it's a struggle, but maybe even maybe even game on it while you're saving up this next, you know, what I'm saying a few weeks because you got 30 days, right? Micro Center, you can take that crap back, but game on it. Try to save up 50 to 100 dollars more, and definitely uh, just just get a 9060 XT or if you can. Let's see if they even have 50, 60 TIs. Let's see what those are. Again, make sure you guys are getting the 16 gigabyte models of these uh, 50, 60s. Uh, the 50, 60 TIs, I'm sorry. Because uh, you don't want to pay for a 50, 60 TI and then be uh, kind of capped on video or on like VRAM. <clears throat> So it's looking like eight gigabytes, eight gigabytes. Those should never be sold out, or if they are in stock. So the, looks like in, looks like the first sixteen gigabyte one in stock is this one down here for four seventy. Oh my god, hold up, four fifty right here. That's just ridiculous. I'm not gonna lie. We got it. We got to hope for some ninety sixties, ninety sixty XT love. Hopefully those come in at a decent price, because uh, like I said, it's just kind of a waste of money at this point, unless you're like truly just only care about like 1080p gaming and you don't really care i guess much about frames but at that point just get a console in my opinion uh, obviously do what you guys do with your money but that's just my opinion you can get a little open box right here 5060 ti but it's the 8 gigabyte model for 356 so <clears throat> i don't know if you bought that 300 dollars 5060 with 8 gigabytes is 56 dollars worth the ti probably not probably not so i don't know you can't really recommend too many options um down in this tier unfortunately but we're gonna check out that 9060 xt when it comes out we'll obviously watch some videos and uh watch some benchmarks but that's really all i had to talk about today was the 4090 restock it's kind of insane that they even thought about restocking this and it's not even that it's just the price point right how are you going to come in with three thousand dollar um 4090s and there's literally, let me just show you guys real quick. There's literally 5090s for cheaper than that. And obviously $3,000 is $3,000. But 20 items in stock right here. You can go over there and get $80 less right here. There's five of these gigabytes. Now right here it says sold out on this one and on the Astral. More than likely, if you have it clicked where it says only show the in stock ones, more than likely these are open boxes. So that's another thing to look out at on microcenter.com is these little sections right here where it says sold out. But as long as you're in the in stock, more than likely, that means there's an open box there. Don't quote me on that. Don't tell me. Don't come back and be mad because, you know, what I'm saying I don't I don't control micro centers website. But that is uh, that's basically what we've what we've come to find out, at least at the one in the St. Louis area. So, again, that's all I got. I'm going to end this video right here. If you guys want to help your boy out by liking the video, subscribe to the channel, tell somebody how you darn, and uh, yeah, that's going to do it. I'll see you guys at the next one. Appreciate it.